Hey guys and welcome to Arsenal Crew. This is the match review of the 2-1 win against Newcastle United. Um, it was a game of definitely two halves. Definitely. Um, we dominated the first half. Um, we should have been 3-4-5 nil up if we had put the chances away. But we didn't. So we sort of seemed like we were going to be living to rue those mistakes. That we didn't put those chances away in the second half. Luckily, that didn't happen. But in the second half, I don't think our approach changed. It was just Newcastle's approach changed. In the first half, they gave us time on the ball. And in the second half, it was the opposite. Every time a player got the ball, they were in their faces and getting on. So, literally, it was... I think it was just Newcastle's changing of game. I think that's all that happened was that and in the first half with them letting us have time on the ball if you let Arsenal have time on the ball really you it will just they'll punish you because we're so good with that if you give us time on the ball then we're going to pick a killer pass and we're going to punish that team so luckily we got the business done in the first half we got to thank I think in the second half Ospina and Koscielny because I think they were Pretty much outstanding in the second half. There was a couple of wobbles from Koscielny. But Koscielny, he kept on sort of trying to header it out. And tackling, last ditch defending. But then Ospina. Um, he is... His, his reflexes is unreal. Like, I play in goal. And if I had half the reflexes that he has, it, I would... I could probably play for a professional team. His reflexes are unbelievable. And he just, he saved us. And I am still a Chesney fan. I still do adore Chesney. He still is a good goalkeeper, no matter what people say. But Ospina is better. Um, he His reflexes are so much better. His diving is so much better. Um, his claiming of the ball, even though he's smaller than Chesney, he seems to be claiming more balls and punching more balls out than Chesney does. It just, it might not reflect that in stats or something like that, but it, it does seem like that. I haven't really looked at any stats about it, but it does seem that way that he is getting more claims, he is getting more saves, he's doing more diving, like he does more, because he's smaller, he's going to do more sort of theatrical diving and it looks quite good actually he does and for anyone that wants to be a professional goalkeeper they need to just look at Ospina and see the way that he plays um is unreal and his reflexes like I said are unreal and he saved us in that game um Newcastle second half I think on the performance of the first and second half, I think what would have been right for both teams was it would be a draw, but we stuck it out and we um, managed to come away with the three points. But because we dominated the first half and they dominated the second half, it should have really been a draw because that would have been a fair result. But we're not all about fair results over here. We want we want to win. We need to win, and we won. So. And it gives us a bit of um, positive momentum going um, into the Liverpool game because I think we do need that. It's good that we got a sort of a shaky game out the way now and now we can put a strong performance against Liverpool and I think that might even, if we beat Liverpool, it could um, really stand us a good chance of... Um, get in second place and you never know we can still keep believing um the league we could still win the league if it's still mathematically possible then we can still win um so you never know but guys make sure to subscribe to arsenal crew like the video sorry about the camera angle it is a bit fucked up but the sun is an absolute bastard um if you look well i'd normally have the camera my face is all blurred out and it's horrible so I've had to have it over here so sorry about the camera angle guys um but for now 
I'll see you in the next video. Remember to like, subscribe, and follow us on Twitter. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye.